Hey everyone, welcome back. So on the subject of security, sometimes you need to be sure that you have the utmost security when carrying out online activities. And out of all the VPNs out there, NordVPN offers that security with a feature called Double VPN. So under more connection options, you can see the drop down. I was recently using it, but as you can see, all of their other features are listed below and I'll touch on those in a sec. But this feature, the Double VPN, it enhances your security by routing your internet traffic through two Two different VPN servers instead of one. So it adds an extra layer of encryption anonymity. If you want to just skip to the full review or directly subscribe to Nord, just head to the link in the description and feel free to use the discount codes to make it even cheaper than it already is. So what do I mean by two VPNs you ask? When you connect to Nord VPN's double VPN feature, your data gets encrypted, aka gets converted into like an unreadable code twice. So this means your original IP address is encrypted by the first VPN server Server. As you can see, I'm now connected to Netherlands and to Sweden. And then uh, the encrypted data from the Netherlands to Sweden here gets decrypted and re-encrypted with a second layer of encryption. This double encryption, it makes it extremely difficult for anyone, including your internet service provider or attackers, to figure out what you're doing online. And if I say encryption one more time... <laughs> So ultimately, the double VPN enhances your anonymity by masking your original IP address twice. So even if someone manages to intercept your connection at one VPN server, in this case in the Netherlands, which is literally almost unheard of with Nord, they would only see encrypted data and the IP address of like the second VPN server, not your real IP address. So ultimately, like I said, the, the point of a double VPN is heightened security. So no wonder it's got two layers of military grade encryption with Nord. That makes it just highly secure against, you know, cyber threats or especially if you want to use it to protect yourself when you're doing things online like financial transactions or trading with cryptocurrency or if you're like in a high risk location or using public Wi-Fi even. So I would say that the drawbacks would be your internet speed might be a little slower compared to a single VPN connection because, I mean, again, double VPN reroutes your connection through two servers instead of one. So it also depends on how far away the servers are from your location. In this case, Nord chose the best available servers, but we can change that again to, if we uh, click double VPN here, what it's gonna do is just reroute it to a different pair of servers. There are also definitely fewer double VPN options available out of Nord's 6400. So you can see I'm connected now to Sweden, Switzerland. Yeah, Nord has 6400 servers across 111 countries, but they do still provide dedicated double VPN servers, about 48 of them for users who opt for this enhanced security option. But that's literally the most servers out of VPNs of this caliber as well. So all in all, a double VPN is pretty unnecessary for everyday browsing or streaming activities because with Nord even a single VPN works great since they're one of the top VPNs out there already but the double VPN is typically recommended for specific instances like I mentioned earlier where you require like that maximum security and anonymity so that's all for today's video I mean overall I would recommend Nord's double VPN it's like a really powerful feature and it's designed to provide that maximum security at the times that you need it and by encrypting your data twice and if you're prioritizing that or you require that due to your job or whatever else you have on the go, again, just click the link in the description below. You can read the full review and decide for yourself, but also just grab the discount because why not? Why wouldn't you want to save money and make this cheaper? So again, that's all for today's video. Thank you so much for watching and be sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.